Well, as promised, here is part two of the adventures um, out in Lone Pine and in um, eastern Sierra Mountains and, and um, the Alabama Hills, a couple of mines, a couple of different spots. And as you'll be able to see, I'm still not quite sure how to do a video right or how to edit it right, but I'm getting there. And I'll get there eventually. Um, I hope you enjoy it. Um, the ending is blunt like all my endings are so far, but I'll figure out how to do it right eventually. And I hope you enjoyed this one, and thanks for watching. Remember the channel. Subscribe, hit the bell. No, I'm just kidding, I don't care. <laughs> um, that's all for now, and enjoy the video. Thank you. This is lunch. It's gonna slowly pan. This is, um, Okay, I guess I was filming good. Walk on down this way now. Get a bit of view. That, folks, is what you call a pretty view. That, folks, is what you call a Zeke. And there's Beth. Rex. I think that's stopped for a photo also. You can loop out this way, so if you guys aren't following, come on along. We'll all, we can meet you back at the main road. I was just curious. That's got a photo op I'm just waiting for. I'm doing a little photo op myself. There's some pinnacles. This is just so cool, folks. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Let's see what's up here. Doesn't get much prettier than that. Sorry for the washboard noise. We're here at Manzanar. The Japanese were interned during World War II. There's some of the barracks. This is a little more representative, I think. I don't need to go through all the buildings. No. no. This just represents, you see every sign there was a building. 
that's where the animals are. These have a nice view to look. Had a computer? No, I don't think so. Okay. Uh, that building over there was the rec center. And we're done. And the buildings over there. Yeah, men's is men's is yeah. men's is our sucked, but it wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. But I didn't have to live here. Huh. Okay, that's all. Sure, exactly where we are. We're on top of this hill. Why? I am coming up. Oh, I see. Sorry. That's all right. This is quite a mesa. I wonder what this is called. Trying not to fall. Wow. Weird. That is weird. Like some other mineral came in along a crack yeah. line and Alabama hills here because I'm not positive I got a lot of footage of them. See whatever there. That's the idea of them. 
Shabby. Driving down what's called Movie Road. I think it's Movie Road. And um, a lot of cowboy movies and stuff were shot. Cowboy movies were shot here. Having the perfect background. Board. But we're not aired now. Probably should be aired. It does now. not look too bad. Yeah. Ah, it's beautiful. that said no vehicle? At the beginning I thought the Jeep sign, it was a sign that showed a Jeep that said it was okay. And I see tire tracks in front of me. I said no vehicles, bigger and crap. Okay, then. No. Yeah, I mean, I'm already committed, but you guys make your call. What does this say? Oh, I think it's a sign, on a side though. I don't think it's the main road. There's one on one side, one on the other side. And they're uh, facing the uh, field there on the side. Yep, and we have a turn loop up here, so this is good. No, I agree with Rex that this is for the side. They don't want us to get off the road here. Beautiful. A little hissing there, we're airing down some tires here. Not sure you can see it. Getting you know, these done because it's bad. But we're up here to mine, and I don't know the name of the mine. It was pretty rough getting up, so I thought I'd air down from the back. And there's our view. And here's the mine. 
They say you can drive a Jeep in there if it's not too high, but and it looks like I could, but I'm not going to risk hitting my hood on it. I'll hike through it a little bit. I think it's going to be too dark for everybody to see in there. It's got a flash, which I don't have on this. Let's walk in just a little ways so you can get the idea of the size of this sucker. As mines go, this is huge. Go on that corner, it's gonna be dark as hell. I think we could drive in here. Turn around, look at the exit. <laughs> but I won't be able to see anything in there with um, the camera, so I'm not gonna bring it in when we do the hike. It's chilly in here, too. It's nice outside, but it's probably 15 degrees cooler here. When I edit this, I'll post the name of the mine so that there's no mistake of where we're at. Everybody else is airing down below like I should have. We'll wait for them. I'm going to find some flashlights. And head on in. Oh. West of Independence. I think that's Independence way down there. There's the view from the back side. We're up just about 6,000 feet. John Muir Wilderness. See, there's bears in the area. And they have some food containers here built for bears. Very interesting. It's our group eating lunch. This beautiful tree. Jeeps.
My USGS, I don't have this downloaded, but it does not show this road going this far, and it kind of shows it ending here. But so far, this is looking pretty good, so I'm going to keep going. I don't know, Tom, if your map shows anything different. Nope. So, just keep wheeling. I think we got plenty of gas to get out if we have to, but otherwise, it's reasonably good trekking, it looks like. Started to that little water crossing there, and it's on. One more time, we have this little water crossing here. I'm going to try to have Beth in it first. I don't know if she's going through. She's taking pictures too, I think. Oh, I think we're in luck. It looks like this road just keeps going and going. So how was that for a nice blunt ending? Just like all the rest of them, huh? It'll be better next time, I hope. Um, so that's it for the two-part series of the Lone Pine area. Uh, I had a great time filming it, and I hope you had some fun watching it. And more to come, I hope, probably once a month, maybe if I'm lucky. And you all sit back and have a good day, and I'll see you next time.